Hello everyone and welcome to what is quite possibly the biggest unboxing I have ever done on Jurassic Collectibles. As per usual you can see the little Walmart logo just here. Um, I'll give you a look at the box actually so you can see how huge this box is. This is absolutely massive. There is so much good stuff in here and that is why we're zoomed in the way we are because if I was to give you a wider look at this box, as you can see just here, it literally eats up the entire studio. There is so much cool stuff in here. Uh, a huge shout out to my buddy Collect Jurassic. Tim, as always, has come through with hooking me up with stuff. If you didn't know, I actually work with Tim, I do some of the posts on the Instagram page uh, and help to run Collect Jurassic. Um, Tim is such a great guy and really one of the best friends I've made in the Jurassic community. So if you'd actually like to see Jurassic Collectibles x Collect Jurassic, some kind of collab in the future, let me know if you've got ideas for what we could do together and we will have a think. We have toyed with whether we could do a podcast. Uh, or something similar. So if that's something you would be interested in, do let me know. Now with all of that out of the way, let's get into this parcel. You can see we have got a massive Walmart box. Honestly so big that my scissors are struggling to cut through. There we go. This is potentially going to be a challenge to get this open just make sure that's in focus for you guys. I can imagine the focus is going to be uh, fluctuating a little bit throughout this unboxing. I am just going to make it a little bit brighter here just so you... yeah we'll do that. Just to make sure the quality is a bit better there. Because I did notice a bit of flickering on the camera. We do get that now and then, unfortunately. It's just um, with the room I'm in, it's quite a dark room normally. Um, now, with the lights on, it creates a very, very bright space. But the contrast can be a little bit of a challenge for my camera. So, we're going to bring this down. That is going to push out the entire back section of the studio. And you can see we have a ton of bubble wrap. This almost feels like the bubble wrap I sent with Tim's last parcel, so that would be hilarious if it had made its way back to me. Now, <laughs> this is like the, the ultimate unboxing experience right here. So we are going to turn this over, just so there's not an address exposed there. There is another one here that we're gonna turn over. <laughs> so, right. Here we have got the parcel. Now first things first, we have got this padded envelope and we have also got this box just here. And these are Marauder Gunrunner packages. So not exposing the address on there at all because they have been shipped to Tim, but they are Marauder Gunrunner packages. So they are awesome. They are something that I just collect. Um, so it's good to have them. Now Tim, I was asking about a spare Mandalorian a while ago in our group chat and he threw, threw the Mando in here. You can see that Mando there. I do now have another Mandalorian uh, because I'm impatient, I bought one. But hey, never gonna say no to another Mando. Now after that we have got Hammond Collection Claire and that face sculpt is great. Tim sort of waited with Claire for me uh, until there were some that released with slightly better head sculpts and he made sure to get one of the ones that has got a better head sculpt. So we have got Hammond Collection Claire. We have then got Delta, the Velociraptor. You guys kind of know the drill at this point. A lot of my Hammond Collection goodies come from Tim. We have got a couple of the Pyroraptor, I believe. Really, really great looking figure. Really excited to review this one. I think I bought a couple. Yeah, I did. Uh, so we have another one just there. That's me <laughs> standing on bubble wrap and making myself jump as I do that. But there we go. There's a Pyroraptor. 
really cool stuff. We have got another Dennis Nedry 93 classic set. That is for Connor Ontology. So Connor, I have that for you next time I see you. It is yours, my friend. We then have got two really cool things, which are the Captives Rumble Cages. So these are kind of a bit of a phenomenon online because they're big enough to fit Mattel figures. So although they're designed for captives, you can use these for attack packs and you can see eventually captives are going to be giving us a little arena. So I'm excited to get that. So these were available on Walmart. I did order two of them just because they are going to be really useful for toy photography. So thank you for those, Tim. Now we then have got the Hammond Collection Therizinosaurus. Been excited for this one for a while. Really, really cool to get it in hand. Looks like a phenomenal Hammond Collection figure. Now sticking with the Jurassic World Dominion theme, we can't get the Theranotosaurus without the Giganotosaurus. And what I'm noticing right off the bat is these are bloody heavy figures. So a lot of plastic packed in there. Really excited to review this one for you guys. Excited to have it in hand. You can kind of see just there. It looks absolutely gorgeous. I am so happy to have this. And then lastly, but certainly not least by any stretch, we have got the 93 classic Tyrannosaurus Rex. So we've got the classic Jeep, we've got the Kenner Coloured Rex, we've got Arnold, we've got the Capture Gear. This is a really cool release from Mattel. So that is it guys, possibly my biggest haul yet. If you've watched all of them to date, let me know. Do you think this is the biggest one I've done? Huge thanks to Tim, as always, for holding these for me, for making it possible. Really, guys, the only reason I still do reviews is because of Tim. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be able to get half of the products I'm interested in. We could have a whole separate discussion about Mattel and their distribution. If you want to hear that discussion, do let me know. But as I say, Tim is the person who makes so much of this possible. So thanks again, Tim. Really appreciate you, buddy. And for all of you who have made it this far, if you've enjoyed this video, make sure to like, favourite and subscribe. And until the next time, take care and have a great week. Thank you.